What's up guys, Curtis here from Matador Darts and today I'm going to be making a video on why some players use different coloured darts flights. Okay guys, as you can see here I actually have uh, two dart flights that are black and one that is red. And um, I think the main player that uses different colored dart flights that I can think of is Ricky Evans, or at least he did use different colored dart flights. And um, the main reason for this is sort of like a concentration method. If you watch uh, Ricky, Ricky Evans play, at least when he had different colored darts flights, um, you'll notice they always go in in the same order. So I think he used to use like yellow, pink, and like white or something, or just three different colors, and you'd always see the same colors go in at the same time. So you're first dart would be the same colour, the second dart would be the same colour every time you make a visit to the board and this is for concentration reasons and I'll show you that now. Okay guys as you can see I have my darts here um, what I would do is I retrieve them from the board and then I would walk my way back around the back of my opponent and it's just a concentration thing so you'd go behind your opponent and you would take your darts and you would put them in the order that you want to throw them so for me in my case um, I would always throw black, red, black so I'd look at my darts, and as you can see, the red one here is on the end. So what I would do is I'd take the end dart, push it around here, straighten them up, get ready so I can throw, and then by the time I've done that, my opponent will have at least finished his visit and he'll be going to retrieve his darts. This just helps players with their concentration. Obviously, if you're looking at your opponent's score and he hits a 180, you think, oh, bloody hell, he's hit a 180, I've got to do something special here, and that really messes with your concentration. Whereas if you're just looking at your darts, even if you hear the call, you don't actually have to sort of look at the board if you see the darts going in you think oh no he's hit a 60 he's hit another 60 he's hit another 60 he's hit a 180 and he's hit a big score so the idea of rearranging your flights is just to keep your concentration the only problem i'll say with this guys is obviously don't try and make too much noise with your darts especially if you're in like a quiet sort of pub setting or a super league setting because obviously you don't want to be coming around and like jangling your darts together because it is off-putting and it is seen as a bit of gamesmanship so like i said just make sure you try and do it as quiet as possible just so you focus just pull your darts apart and just go, okay, the red one needs to be in the middle, so I will do that. And then when you get ready to throw, then you can just sort of pull your darts together and make that little bit of noise. And yeah, guys, that is pretty much it for this video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.